CBS 47 Action News. Low family searching justice for their son is finding inspiration from the parents of Trayvon Martin. Action News was the only local station invited for their first meeting in the AM. Gather Jordan Davis's parents and Trayvon Martin's mother and father want to stop since son violence. Now you'll remember both boys were shot to death last year in Florida. And now their parents are joining forces and adding some star power as well in their fight for closure. Action News Noel McLaren just returned from Miami. Noel, even actor Jamie Foxx is joining this crusade. Yeah, I'm told he missed the Grammy specifically to be at the event last night, showing his passion to help these parents and senseless gun violence. Forget the Grammys. This is where Oscar winner Jamie Foxx said he had to be Sunday night, celebrating what would have been Trayvon Martin's 18th birthday. We don't want to wrap our arms around the children. And uh, that's the message we want to send. That's that simple. We, we came down just to support them. In the years since he was killed, Trayvon's tragedy has grabbed the attention of people all over the country. There wasn't an empty seat in the house at his remembrance dinner. For friends and family, those who never got the chance to meet Trayvon, but have been touched by his story. Like the father of Jacksonville teen, George Davis, who police it was killed because he was playing loud music. Our communication lines all the time. In a first meeting as natural as any family gathering, Jordan Davis and Trayvon Martin's parents shook hands for the very first time. Two fathers bound by a pain no parent should ever have to feel. It's definitely one of those fraternities that you wouldn't want to be a part of. Uh, we didn't choose this role. Our kids didn't choose their fate. Uh, but as God see it fit, we're going to stand in the gap for them. A powerful moment for both families searching for a glimmer of hope in their hardships. God has our children up there, and they're yes, probably maybe. playing together right there. They spoke of ending gun violence in the hope that no other child will have to suffer the same fate as Trayvon and Jordan. We're in this together. We're in it for the long haul. And both families tell me they will only be a phone call away from each other during their respective trials. Right. Mark, Tara? Definitely an emotional time for Absolutely. both of them. It was very emotional last night. Powerful, uh -huh. too. Noel, thanks. Thanks, Thank Noel. Well, the mayor proclaimed this Saturday, Jordan Davis Day, there's going to be a celebration of his life at the Jacksonville Landing. As for the suspects in both cases, Michael Dunn is scheduled to be back in court on the 19th. He's facing one count of murder and three counts of murder.